welcome to Galloway Lights. It's been uh, the third day now since I put in 10 packages of bees. It's kind of like raising kids, I guess. We're going to be feeding them. I'm not sure how often, but we're going to check them again today. Now, I noticed a lot of these bees are up here on the tops. They're still moving. But they got caught in the rain. I don't know, maybe I'm going to try and dump these inside, see if they can survive. Like this poor guy. Here's one that didn't get so drenched. But they're very slow moving. It's been pouring rain day and night so far. Oh, he's got a stinger up, but I guess he can't sting yet. Too cold. So this is hive number two. Food's about an inch thick. So we're going to fill this up. This is fun because now I'm using it by the bucket. I'm going to turn this the other way just because maybe it's not over the hole right. And I've got a bunch of bees that were on the entrance so we're going to dump them inside. And that's a disaster because now they're bailing out everywhere. Ow! And one got me right there. So that one's dead too. Whichever one that, that was. Look for the bee that has the stinger missing. Come on, stay in there. Nope, still got two missing. So what do you do with these two? What do you do with bees that are half drowned? Nothing you can do with them. Stick them at the entrance and poke them in. Well, how do you get them in there? Find yourself a stick or something? Come on, bee. Let's do the walk. Let's go back inside. There you go, in there. Well, we might have saved one. But now you know what I'm going to be doing for the next couple days. Feeding bees. Here's hive number one. They've got the same bees on the bottom. The bees on the top. I don't know if they're still moving or not. Let's see how all we got in here. We got quite a bit of bees in here and they still got quite a, quite a bit, so let's see if we can get them in there. Now that one was successful. And we got number three. See, this is what I'm talking about. See that? Still moving. What do you do with that? I don't know. I don't know if they're dead or alive, or they're just... Yeah, see that one's moving. Still moving. Can we get them in? Ah! I got more on the outside than I got on the inside. Alright, that works. I'd call that success. Let's check out number four. Where is it? There it is. Oh, 
when I filled these up all the way to the top it was a two liter so I guess they got a liter full so far that they took that one looks pretty healthy I don't know about the rest of these we'll give it a shot if they're dead they'll be carried back out See if we can get them in there. Now we got more floating than we got in there. What a challenge. All right, we got them in there. Let's check out number five. Dude, these are coming out of the front. You see that? They're coming out and getting stuck right on the top. They don't know it's cold out here. Look at this. That's the problem right there. It's too cold. They just came from Georgia, I guess, and they don't really know that it's cold out. Welcome to Jersey. This one's almost empty. And there's another one that got out. All right, now, let's see if we can get this one back in there. Go back in there. And this one, and this one. There we go. Hopefully they know how to swim. All right, let's try number six. Another one stuck on the top. Another one that has no idea that it's winter. It's winter. I'm telling you guys, it's winter. What is this? Here, want a free ride? another one out there. Dude. Ah. That one just swam underneath. You saw that? Oh, man. What do you do with these guys? Any ideas how you save all these bees? Drop them in one at a time. All right, that works. Well, I'm out of sugar water. I go make some more. Well, now you know what I'm going to be doing for the next couple of days. Thanks for watching.